This clinical case deals with a 62-year-old woman who has a previous medical history of recurrent sub-occlusive syndromes lasting for several months. She was admitted to the hospital for chronic abdominal pain and sub-occlusive syndromes. The colonoscopy showed mild diffuse diverticulosis, impossible to intubate the terminal ileum. A small bowel video capsule was performed after appropriate bowel preparation, 2 liters of polyethylene glycol. The first step is to select the name of the patient from the list. This screen displays all of the features of the reading software, with the most useful for diagnosis being the express selected mode. At this stage, the quality of the recording is assessed, including the presence or absence of debris or bubbles. The 3D tracking graph is activated by thumbnail images of landmarks, for example, the first gastric image, the first duodenal image, and the first cecal image. Individual images can be enhanced or reviewed using these software functions. However, the diagnosis relies on the express selected mode, which allows selection of video images. The red signal is not informative and a first assessment is carried out in the overview mode. However, the most useful software feature in this case is the express selected mode. Minor inflammation is clearly visible in the distal part of the ileum and is captured at 11 hours 3 minutes from the beginning of the video capsule recording. External protrusion is suspected in this picture, with debris trapped in the ileum lumen. Also, mucosal redness is apparent. One of the aspects of capsule examination that makes diagnosis difficult is the inability to use endoscopic tools such as air insufflation or biopsy. The overview mode with enhanced picture and multiple image bar allow this tricky capsule aspect to be assessed.
Here we see the capsule view of another external compression. In such a condition, normal mode and skipped selected mode are also required in order to analyze carefully this part of the recording. For this patient with external compression, capsule examination lasted more than 16 hours and the cecum was not reached due to delayed passage of the device. Time-consuming reading time was reduced by software improvements, particularly the express selected mode. In order to complete the report, adequate thumbnails are selected and included in the printed report. Medical terms stored in the software can be used to write the report. A physician signature is mandatory before saving and finalizing the video recording diagnosis.